Armstrong. Well, this coming Monday is Martin Luther King Jr. Day. And to commemorate the civil rights icon's birthday, the lacrosse community will once again celebrate his message and honor people who carry on his legacy. News 19's Dustin Lukey spoke with this year's MLK Jr. Leadership Award recipient. And Dustin, who earned the honor this year? Well, Heather, as we often see with awards like this, it's someone who says they were surprised and didn't think they deserved the honor, but someone whose work inspired friends and colleagues to overwhelmingly push for this recognition. Now, you may know Will Van Rosenbeek as the director of UW Lacrosse's Pride Center, but in addition to his work at the university and supporting LGBTQ plus community members in lacrosse, Will has also facilitated a number of youth programs including the MLK Project, which partnered with local high schools to take kids on week-long freedom rides to some of the communities where Dr. King worked firsthand to change how people see those who are different from them, something that Will says can be easy to overlook in our day-to-day -day lives. It's so easy if the injustice isn't against you to be like, I don't have to worry about it. Um, but if we really think that any injustice um, even though it might not impact me directly today, um, certainly is an impact to me because it's impacting another human being that is a part of the world which I'm a part of. And, um, you know, if we don't fight for one another and stick up for one another, um, you know, that is where I think we see um, where we other, we other people and we um, withhold things from other people who should have the same rights as us. Now, Will adds that a lot of what Dr. King stood up against is still what we're seeing today, but with different communities sometimes. He mentioned specifically people without a home in our area. And coming up tonight at 10, Heather, what Will says are two things all of us can do to help move toward Dr. King's beloved community. And we'll introduce you to the student who's also being recognized this year. All right, I love it. Thank you, Dustin. Now, one thing you can do in the meantime is make plans to attend the free MLK Jr. Community Celebration. You can attend in person or you can do it live stream. We'll have that link on our website. That's Monday night at 7 at the Viterbo Fine Arts Center with featured speaker Dr. Alexander G. He's the CEO of the Center for Black Excellence and Culture. That event is free and open to the public. We'll turn